test test there we go oh i know i was uh i was testing blues okay we're on mic for the moment here while we get everything all queued up how are things how have things been i know i'm a bit late but i was updating the pack and i um was making it available to everybody in discord in our discord homebrew section i got the uh zip file for the pack added in golemancy woo oh i gotta fix that i can't see the alert thank you those thank you the blues let me fix that the the alert was like behind my camera so i always can see half of it which is really weird we need to fix that <laughs> yeah that's not right that all right there we go <laughs> let me play that so that way it shows appropriately <laughs> still not showing what the heck that was a thing okay we're getting better Well, I guess I'll mess with that later. I want that to be above my camera thing, but whatever. Okay, might be, might be a bit quiet. Oh, um, here I will. How's that? Is that better? It won't be on this for long. I'll be putting on my ears in a second. I just like to uh, start off with my head free. You are still quiet. This is going to be loud. How about now? Okay. Usually this mic picks things up really loud, and so I start it a little bit softer. Okay. So what we added to the pack was something called Golemancy. So you can actually capture souls and turn them into golems, and they will do different things. You can get souls from Endermen, Creepers, and everything else. So you can make bodies do work for you. You can customize them. Oh! It's too loud now. Too loud now. I'll go somewhere in the middle. How about now? I, I, I did have it maxed. Don't sweat it, guys. I'm going to be moving to my headsets here, like, real right quick. Way too soft now. <laughs> Dang that it. Okay. I'm now between where I was before and it was too loud and where it was too soft. This should be the Goldilocks volume, right? <laughs> I might just give up and put on my ears. <laughs> but yeah, the Golemancy is going to be fun. Hmm, better, still a little loud, but okay, put on your ears. Fine, fine, fine. fine. These jeans are heavy, I have to wear them at work all day, and didn't want to do it yet. Man. Test, test, test. All right, and my lovely, beautiful, and the correct, my hair looks funny, that's because it's wet. <laughs> I just got out of the shower. <laughs> um, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's where it dries first, Blues. That's just what happens. I look really funny in transition. This will all poof out, and it'll kind of <laughs> slowly poof as a way back. It's just what it does. But I don't care. It's just what it does. If I look funny, I look funny. <laughs> okay. So let's load her up. Okay, I'm going to get our sandwiches now. Yeah, yeah, you go do that. Um, are you going to be listening on your phone as you get those sandwiches? He asked for no reason. Or no. That's Alan's pond. You took his leap pad. Let him have his pond. Hey, it's Lord Billy. I've been boopeted. Alan owns it now, Sassy. See, Blues, the arbiter of all things froggy, has determined that that is Alan's pond, and it shall remain. 
You stole his lily pad, his pond stays. <laughs> and you can have it for now. Good. Be a good rogue. He's got the deed for it and everything. It's official. It's right here on this piece of paper. Officially. <laughs> the deed to the... <laughs> All right. So, let us go ahead and migrate over into the game here. Hey, look at that! Found it right away. That is a good sign. Okay, sweet. Sus. <laughs> Sassy, it's a legally binding paper. <laughs> you won't be listening. Good, good. There's nothing for you to hear anyway. I mean, nothing nothing uh, would be happening there. <laughs> Everything is fine. And unsuspicious. There we go. We'll move the phone up here so it has the chats. Okay, we're going to test something here. Test chat real quick. Oh, good. It's working. Okay. <laughs> All right, let us jump in to the world. So I'm excited here, because I think today we're going to actually get some moving parts into the Tesseract. I want to get... Do we have sounds? Are those all coming out of the right thing? Hold up, guys. I think I'm getting sounds double. Ah! Okay, there we go. That's better. Oh yeah, first things first. Well, we sleep. Let's get rid of this terrible night. So, I'm trying to remember. Uh, it might be an episode or so ago, but... I did get my atlas back for like the 15th time. And I have made a copy of it in here. And I think any changes that happen here will happen here. You stack. Oh, they don't. They are technically different. This one has no death marker. Huh. Let's do a little test. If we put something here, test. Will that now appear here too? Awesome. So I don't have to like continually update. That's good. How are you? Love your nature. Of a very pleasing nature. Thank you. <laughs> okay I'll put that there okay so we have the framework done so if you kind of watch my cursor here so between this slat and this slat and that little gray line if you magic that is a three dimensional box that's the box where you can put nature stuff and uh, that's the range in which the altar, if placed right there, will be able to absorb energy. The outer side, from this gray bar outward, represents area that it can power. And then, of course, that means that this whole, if you're thinking about three dimensions, that means this space here would all be powered, and underneath this space here would all be powered. So all those edges are places where we can have things like rituals and anything else, cauldron stuff, anything that we might need. So that means we need to power this thing. Which means we need to get... Let's see. More wither skulls. And we made lots of these altars. We also have been needing blaze rods and blaze powder for years. Okay, we there we go. And I, even though we don't need it for this, we still need it for other recipes, like, really badly. So, here's what we're going to do. There's something called... Let's see. This helps you find biomes. This ha helps you find structures. So for this, we need webs. We have only two webs. And webs... 
cannot be crafted. They have to be found in this pack. Now, does anybody remember when we were down here, did we come across a... Uh, Oh, hold up. We have a guest. Did we come across any mine shafts down there? I am trying to remember. Where's the Enderman at? Do you guys remember if there was a mine shaft down there? Because we need some webs. And Sassy's not here, so I can't steal them from her right now. <laughs> Otherwise, I would totally set up a, a trade. Or a heist. There you go. Thank you, Enderman. Oh, yeah. We did make a dank, finally. That's not it. Oh, this thing is such a godsend. I mean, we have, like, 741 bricks in here. And these things don't stack, but they can be put in here. Thousand. Oh, it's so freaking nice. I love this thing. I'm going to take it that nobody remembers if we... Uh, that's a tower of fish. <laughs> there. Cool. We got enough food. <laughs> Nice. Take that with us. Okay. Well, plan B is we found a Death Bunny arena up here. And there's also Temple of the Monkey King. And a Cursed Village. I think one of these places will have a... Um, Maybe even the Flying Atlantis here <laughs> might have some webs in them, because these are basically dungeons, and they're not too far. In response to my question, if there were <laughs> any mine shafts below our base, I get a response from Blues, Creeper Face. Thank you. That's very clear. <laughs> okay, so we will um, go boat. Get rid of that. Mm. I want... Let's see, where are they? We had some of these swords. Poison clouds swirling. That's interesting. Vein of arthropods. Stunning and poison... That seems really good. I peeled off some enchants here. Where is the book? There it is. Looting 3. That's what I want. Get that on there. Nice. Knockback 2, Looting 2, Humanity 2, Fire Aspect 2, and Sharpness 5. Okay. Perfect. Oh, the story evolves. Creeper plus fade explosion. Yeah, yeah. That that is that is accurate. Am I hold up? Am I am emote only? I'm making sure that it's not on emote. I I've been turning it on. It's not an emote only. Okay, good. I've been turning it on. Touch the boom boom. Do you see a boom boom? Why you want me to poke the boom boom blues? <laughs> okay. So we're going to head out that way. Now we need to be prepared. So we got some things set up in advance. We got 19 tag locks from Sassy, which is awesome. Okay, we might as well get our... Potions ready here. No clue. I just want it to happen. Fire resistance, why not? Is that night vision? Yeah, night vision. 
Okay, cool. So we got our exploratory stuff here. And I did migrate much of our stuff that we need for potions over here. I was like, why am I always running back and forth? So, we... are you stuck, Mr. B? Okay. Let's go ahead and do this real quick. I came across another uh, ocean that looks pretty fun here that I want to try. It's going to help us with our travels. Make things so much easier. Obviously a little spider's eye. Oh yeah, that, that tarry stuff looks tasty. There's no house on this island. Correct. That is going to be my living quarters here. Now, I am going to give it a nice looking facade. It's not just going to look like a box. I'm building the inside stuff first. I'm going to build the, the pretty stuff around it. I just don't know how much space the mechanical stuff is going to take up yet, so I'm going to wait on the pretties until I get the, uh... We'll get the aesthetics once we have the mechanics in there. The functional. Okay. And we need three redstone. One, two, three. One, two, three. And our bottles. Boom, boom. There we go. One, two, three. We got some climbing potions. Yes. Cool. Blunk. 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 Okay. Neat. And we'll give those an extra extension here. Looking forward to having the the battery in there in place. Then we can start moving our rituals in there. Then we're going to be powerful. We got to do something because Sassy set up a little bit of facility with a bunch of villagers. Uses lightning strike to scare Fade. That's not funny. <laughs> you know what? I should though include a lightning strike sound in here, considering what's happened all the time. I really should add that to sound alerts, since I have this tendency just gets struck by lightning randomly oh yeah the other day after we did our scene with sass you know and i was like when when we were uh, getting her home i was in the world standing right about here and then i was off screen i was messing with the sound and then i got freaking like attacked and struck by lightning and everything else oh it was terrible ah. okay plop 80 minutes, which will actually be 160 minutes once I drink it. Fantastic. Great. 160, 160, 160, hour and four minutes, 160. Cool. Actually, the water breathing, I don't need at the moment because I have the snorkel. Okay, cool. There we go. Boy, do I, I love this alchemist. Uh... <laughs> oh. And do we have nourishment? Oh, no, we don't. Okay, let's make some nourishment right quick. So we can make these last a bit longer. Okay. Non-edible plants. There's the bamboo. Okay. I say I saw the clip. It was hilarious. Um, that's gonna definitely go into a, a video. <laughs> I, that will probably be listed as an outtake on Sassy's um, new video that she's editing today. Because that was hilarious. How much power we got in here? We have enough. Okay. Stone. And one, two. And we need to take those 
off. Okay. So glad I put this item stand here. There. Ow! One. Two. And I already put the glowstone in there. I hope so. One, two, three. Six minutes. Okay, we'll extend that. Eh, eh, eh. Eh, eh, eh. And bop, bop, bop. Stop hitting yourself. I gotta stop dipping myself in my own potion. Every potion is very special to me. I put a little bit of myself in it. Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay. There's a nourishing. Okay. Flash. One, two, three. Is this nourishing too? Yes, it is. Excellent. Bop. Okay. Good. So I'll drink that. That's not enough bad tub, bro. Get out of it. Well, you know, we're in ye olde times over here. We have to make do with what we got. <laughs> Okay, whoops, that's not right. Fire. Night vision. And where's our new one, the climbing? Okay, there we go. Nice. Awesome. <laughs> Oh, that's so awesome. I love this. Okay. And while we have nutrition, so these would normally only do about two of each. Nice. Double of each. Hey, DJ, you're just in time. Welcome. How are you doing? We just got them taking up tons of potions. We are about to get what we need to put the super mega battery of doom inside here. It's going to be a gigantic magical energy battery like this. Ooh, how much is in here? Do we have enough for a fortune? I already have a fortune. I don't know what it is. Hope it's good. Okay. So our plan is to get this compass, go to the nether, and use it to find a a uh, fortress because the... the, <laughs> the um, the nether is so heavily modded that there's so many extra biomes in there. It's really hard to find the vanilla ones, and it's really hard to find a freaking fortress to get blaze rods. Sassy looks behind you in the shadows. She sees all that... I'm starting this over. I messed that up. Sassy lurks behind you in the shadows. She sees all, knows all, is all, eats all. Sandwiches. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> it's funny. So, we need spider webs so we can get this thing, so we can find a fortress, so we can find blaze rods. So, here's our preparations here. We got climbing. Just so you know what climbing does, it's amazing. It's a great pair at the grappling hook and slow fall, because I can now just crawl right up walls like I'm a spider. Everything is a ladder to me! And then I can jump off and just glide down. Ooh, hello. Oh, right, I already did that. But yeah, so that's going to make getting around super easy-like. Woo! <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that will give a good, uh, that clip will give a good, um, primer what happened right before we did this. Okay, so we got our food, we got our grappling hook, we got our slow fall. So what are we going to do to get spider webs? We have the flying Atlantis. Spider fade, spider fade. Cue epic animated spider made music. <laughs> okay. Here we go. We're going to go to flying Atlantis first. Then next on our, on our tour, if it's not there, 
we will go to the Cursed Village. Frowny face. And if not there, maybe we'll find it at the Death Bunny Arena. Speaking of, if we're going to go to Death Bunny Arena, we need to take our contingency. Oops, I made a mistake potion. There we go. Ooh. And our go return home potions are nice too. Okay, great. So we have our... Need help. We should also bring a flint and steel. Okay. We're good. And we do not need our wands. And we have our dank null. And shears. Okay. I believe that we are good to go. Let's get out of here. Okay. So... We are here. We need to head down the river this way. Okay. <laughs> ah. You know, I probably could have done with some speed potions, but this will be fine. Actually, I wonder if I might be actually faster in the water. That's okay. Next time, I'll go speed potions. I do have aqua affinity on my stuff. It's probably faster. Hello, what is this? Might we find some treasure along the way? It's not marked. I don't know if I have looted this or not. I have. Okay. Onward. Yeah, being able to float, grapple, and climb. That's awesome. Yeah, that's the thing about... Um, Blue's Wolf says nothing. Oh, there it is. Yeah! <laughs> Why are you freaking strawberry out, Blues? What are you doing? Look at that. You scared her. Flip strawberry coffee. <laughs> is this a boot? What is this? Uh-oh. The time of troubles. This is boat. Oh, that is new. Cool, we'll take all of that. Thank you very much. Uh, Mr. Danky. Oh, I love the Dank so much. Oh, thank you, Mr. Danky. I love you. Okay, what else here? There should be another one, right? Yep. Hi there. Ooh. Take all of that. There might be some good in here. Let's, uh... Let's see. Cosmetic pants. Green mystery. Hey, we got more mystery stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm looking good. Look at that. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys something very important. Because I helped Sassy get back, and I had made her do a trade, I did get the scientific journal. So now, we can start getting into that. That's exciting. You know what, let's put this stuff in here for now. Yeah. Frenzied 3. I'm collecting these because we can peel the enchantments off. Okay. Where was I? Uh-uh. It was right here. Okay. And these boots have swift-footed on them. Okay, cool. All right. 
good deal. I am a fan. There. And we always have the emergency book here. Stay off Sassy's hunk loading issue island. <laughs> yeah. Basically, there was like a just gigantic magical explosion. She blames me. She says it's because I walked over Snowden Morning's great Snowden Morning's grave. But you know, she kind of created that villain. Um, all he wanted to do was be a bard. And in um, Tectopia, there we go. I'm pretty sure there's webs up there. In Tectopia. She forced him to be a farmer, and when zombies attacked, ooh, he was killed, and later re-rose as a snorted morning we know today. And apparently, and, and not only did he rise, he became a freaking necromancer. You cursed the world. <laughs> He's definitely mad. He's definitely mad. But fortunately, there is a uh, university out there to help with the occult. We have Mystatanic University and all the monster fighting powers that they provide. Let's see. As one of the leading forces in research, Mississippi University is greatly is greatly participated also in the discipline of chemistry. Anyway, as you can see, now you're supposed to have uh, be registered with the university to use their equipment, but we don't have time for that. And I know what I'm doing. I'm an old pro, so it'll be fine. This island was supposed to have a water flowing from it. I don't know why it don't. Oh, the knockback is so good. Oh, yes. Okay, fine. Little water bucket. Stay off our island. This is my island, dude. This one's mine. Let's see, her base, let's see, this is only go east. So everything from this side is mine. So this is one I found. Hers is by the beached pirate ship. It's like here. Okay, so we gotta get up there. When we get up there, we'll put some water so that way we don't have to, like... Do I even have blocks to get up there? Uh-oh. I do, because I have Mr. Danky! Okay. I love you, Mr. Danky. I should name that Mr. Danky. Okay. Right about here. Awesome. Mr. Danky's the best. I forgot my water today. I'm thirsty. Oh, there's a turtle. Lots of turtles. What's happening? Why am I climbing? I'm not even pressing anything. I'm just... Why am I flying? I? Um... I want... <laughs> oh, the heck! Can I get down? Uh... <laughs> what is happening? Is there some sort of weird interaction between the grappling hook and climbing that I'm seeing here? That was... 
Okay. Scissors. Okay. Webs, webs, webs. Oh. Okay, I need webs. Webs, webs, webs. Please let me down. Need webs. Oh, it's probably death down there. Um, let's see. I don't know if there's webs down there or not. There's no way up. There's no way up from- Oh! Okay. Okay, okay. Webs? Ow! Rude! Ah, I see you. Okay, we have- I'm sticking to the walls. Okay, let's climb up here. I have to remember, I don't need ladders. I can just, you know, do this. Miss Katonic, you say? Aren't they affiliated with the Dunwich Boxers LLC? <laughs> I have a feeling that's a very clever reference. Unfortunately, it's lost on me, DJ. <laughs> um, it's part of... Um, oh, there's a pirate ship right there. It's Lovecraftian. Um, something Lovecraft. Uh, he was like an old uh, horror novelist. Hello, sassy. Shut the door, you're letting the cold air in. I oh. a sandwich. Thank you. Sassy, there's a weird interaction. I have climbing. Look, look watch this. <laughs> that ain't supposed to happen. That's awesome. Here's your sandwich. <laughs> I just kind of... I'm so sticky, I stick to the air. Thank you for sandwich. You're welcome. Okay. It's not toasted. How dare you? It was broken. No, 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 no! You also had lily pad under the pond. No. He had a basement. Nope. You dropped it. This is the deed, right? Look, look, look. Deed. I see you right now. Uh, and... <laughs> <laughs> you are literally writing stuff. it. Stuff. Whoops. Alan's Scott. This is pretty clear. There are no vowels in that word. <laughs> <laughs> no vowels. It's an abbreviation. S T C T T does not. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Are you ever gonna fall? Um. Or? Basically, the way I fall is I have to grapple myself back down. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Well, at least you don't have, um, fall damage. Yeah, it's a combination of feather falling, so climbing, fall. slow falling, climbing, and the, uh, grappling hook. That's, like, now it acts normal. Okay, we're gonna do this so we can get here next time. I thought there were spider webs in here. But apparently there's not. I don't think so. Dang, I need there to be spider webs. Okay. Let's see. Okay, we'll. Bye. Bye. We'll use six touch one because there's more. <laughs> hey, wait, wait! Come back here with the stuff, man. Uh, no, Alan. It was not notarized. Did Strawberry sell you a bad deed? You should know better, Alan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, message deleted. <laughs> Thou who partake in scam, get disintegrated into nothingness of band lands. Yep. Some bad juju there, don't mess with that. Well, at least I know that my presence is out there and people can find me. Somebody caged that bot. <laughs> Denmark Broxers is a pre-war evacuation company in the Fallout universe, and yes, they are just... Ah! Neat. I love that. That's cool. Borers. Borers. Yes, I do. Yes, you do what? Eh. 
give me this. Uh oh, have I already? I think I has already. I has already. Okay, fine. That's okay. That's why we had backup plans. So, nothing there. The cursed village is next. Bits! Ah! Thank you for the bits. <laughs> it's supposed to rhyme and be a pun on the door, <laughs> except I keep saying it wrong. Uh, this way. Okay. You know, I, it's weird, like, I know a little bit above about the Lovecraftian lore, but I haven't actually read it. It sounds fascinating, actually. In fact, there's a side quest in Fallout 3 where you basically have to destroy the Necronomicon. Oh, that's awesome. Can I please, please be famous? You're famous to me, Blues. Let's see here. We need to go that way. <laughs> Ow! Poison! Oh. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Let's see, are we still nutritioned? We are. Hello, Halur. Is this anything? Terracotta. Yep, that's a thing. Come on. No, you're in here somewhere. There it is. Eh. Not much really going on there. Okay. Mr. Danky, we need you to auto-pick... Oh, there's no sand in here, that's why. There. Thank you, sassy. There we go. Yes! Oh, I love you, Mr. Danky. Mr. Danky's like my best friend. Okay. Pick all this up. And, nope. Be gone! Okay. Just giving you a fair warning. Thank you, sassy. Okay, let's see. Where are we going now? The Cursed Village. This is probably super confusing for you, sassy, if you're not... I have a plan, and there's a reason why I'm doing this. I'm on some errands. Reg won't let me be famous. What are you talk? That's not the kind of fame you want, Blues. <laughs> <laughs> That's the uh, stream equivalent of a dark van off person in a dark van offering you candy. You'd want to say no to that one. I'm ignoring it. Minecraft is telling me to put the cookie down. I'm ignoring it. Sassy put the cookie down. Did you get me cookies? I want cookies. Did you give me cookies to go with my raw sandwich? No blues, my cookie. Sassy, I want cookies. Besides which, the cookies have chocolate in them, so um, you, you can't have it. For, it's not good for Malamutes, sorry. I'm cuter, maybe. <laughs> but it's still my cookie. <laughs> Flip cookies! I love that emote. That thing's funny. This is a neat little area. Look at this. Okay. Yeah, Snow the Morning's minions are everywhere here. Sassy, bring him cookies, milk, and hate! I mean, and hats. <laughs> <laughs> misread that. <laughs> oh, that's funny. There. I love how it automatically just stores it in the dank. Oh, this would be a good place for snakes. Wow, no, I'll skip the hate. Thank you. <laughs> Bring them cookies. Milk. <laughs> <laughs> 
and hate. <laughs> Ooh. Oh yeah, baby. I have looting on the sword. Do, do. That's a kitty. Do, 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 do. Where's the village at? It says hats. Hats. Hate. <laughs> Wait. Where's the cursed village at? Should be this way. Do these chunks get rewritten in the time of troubles? There's a cursed village. Or a village. What made this place cursed anyway? <laughs> Blues just adopted. Bring the hate. <laughs> just, just, I can just, I can just hear it. This deadpan, just, all right. Bring the hate. Okay. What made this place cursed? This is false advertisement. Oh, I gotta be careful of golems. I've just kind of just waltzed right in here. Wasn't being careful at all. Those golems can still kick my alchemist butt. That's the smallest desert I've ever seen. Ow! 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 Stop! From here on, villagers, these mini cactuses are illegal. Am I still nutritioned? No. Well, I'll eat this anyway. Also, I'm very disappointed that your village is not cursed, like it was advertised. Ooh, that's a hole. So that makes this place cursed? App description. It's a sneeze of a desert. Ow, ow! I already- ugh. Okay. Where's my boat? This place is a disappointment. And I lost my boat. My boat's right here. I found my boat. Okay, this place isn't cursed at all. So disappointed. Everybody here. Okay, fine. Next. Alright. So, Cursed Village wasn't cursed. Death Bunny Arena is next. Gosh, if it's not at the Death Bunny Arena, I'm not sure where else to go. Alright, to the Death Bunny Arena. Lord Vinny! He's going to manage to kill himself on the cacti. Your lack of faith I find disturbing, Lord Vinny. Okay. That's it. I'm going to write in my journal. Dear journal. Today, Lord Billy was mean to me. <laughs> I'm just saying it how I see it. Hmm. I'm going to send you a frog in the mail. Then we'll see who's laughing. Okay, we'll do this. Okay. That will take us straight to the Death Bunny Arena. Good luck. This is a pretty river. Is this river named yet? We have the Back Passage River. Curse Village and Death Bunny. Oh, we gotta name this river, don't we? Let's see. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this. We'll call this one Billy's Passage. <laughs> I totally didn't get distracted from work to talk in here. Yes! If I'm doing well enough to be distracting, I take that as a compliment. <laughs> You're flipping a uh, Among Us dude. There. Billy's Passage. All right, this should take us directly to the Death Bunny Arena. Oh, it's turning.
Will it turn back around, I hope? Maybe. Hopefully that S curves back around. I'm looking for cookies. <laughs> well, I'm going to unwrap my raw sandwich. Ooh. I'm so happy how this paper has become one with my sandwich. What did they do to my sandwich? <laughs> did they sit on this sassy? They put a lot of cheese on there, though. I'll give them that. It's all on the paper, because I sat on it, but... Oh, come on. All the cheese is coming off on the paper. Well, there's all my cheese. Doesn't that look... Ah! Okay. They sat on mine, too. Okay, next time we order this, we'll be like, okay, I want it toasted. I'd like to have some extra cheese on there on the meatball sandwich. Hold the butt. I would like this to be a buttless sandwich. This is not a ham sandwich. It's a meatball sandwich. That was attractive. <laughs> you paid for that cheese. I'm going to eat it. There's a new strategy. How many bits to make me stop doing that? <laughs> oh, they didn't cut it cut through all the way either. Okay. I think I literally chose the freaking messiest sandwich I could have to try to nibble on while I stream. Snuggles up the sassy. Aww. <laughs> Poor Billy's trying to comfort. That and his charming wit. <laughs> okay, this is taking me off course. It's going to take me upwards. I think I have to get up on these cliffs. All right. We can do that. hey -ya! But fortunately, this is no problem for us. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I guess we could be uh doing this a little bit faster. He's cheating. I'm not cheating. Look at all the stuff I got. Uh, <laughs> I swear to you that I am not cheating. Th this, I am in... This is the weirdest bug with, um... <laughs> get me on the ground, man. Can I get back on the ground? Thank you. That is the weirdest interaction between climbing, slow falling, and this grappling hook. Look, I had some fizzy lifting drink. He said it was just an experimental concoction. I tried it anyway, and that's what happened. This is why you always wait for the final brew, okay? In conclusion, that's a snake. Come here. And this is a looting sword. Thank you. Oh, these... Oh, that is, that is the way to get tongue. Why did that snake have two tongue? Probably normal. Okay, so Death Bunny Arena is, uh, this, eh, eh, this way. Let's zoom in a bit. There. Always be careful of strange brews. There it is. There's the Death Bunny Arena. I think I see cobwebs. Success. I am so smart. SMRT. Okay. That is the way to get tongue fade out. Oh no. Sassy, why? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> no, that's what I do to you. You're not allowed. <laughs> Be 
Because she can. Oh. Vengeance is real. Just mining in a way. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna mine it anyway. Okay. Awesome. Sassy got her own tongue. From a strange island. Oh, this is great. We're gonna get as many of these as we can. Is that a chest? Huh. Okay, we'll take that. And we'll get Mr. Danky. And boink. And boink. And, uh, junk. Oh, yeah, we'll put those back. Okay, cool. Can I move through these because I'm a spider? No, I still get stuck forever. Okay. I love Mr. Danky. Mr. Danky's the best. And I'm super happy that this plan worked. While I'm here, I should probably go down below and see about that, uh, going down there in terms of the uh, death bunny. Because I know that this area here is hollow. Ooh, there's more. Well, the climbing potion is so nice. Okay, we'll need to collect that. I never want to have this trouble again, so we're going to collect as much as we can. Yes, blue, just yet. Yeah. Wait. He won't give it sassy, he goes. He won't give it sassy, it goes. Flip. I don't know about it. Oh, hi! Ow! Ah! Bad ghost! What's that ghost doing to me? Give me slowness? Come back here. Okay, I, apparently I need to sleep. That guy gave me a tomato. Cannot rest, there's monsters nearby. That can have it. Beat up a zombie, he gave me a tantrum tomato, and then I couldn't sleep. Okay, there we go. Now. We need to see what's going on in here. We'll use... The Silk Touch one has more energy on it, so we'll... Ah! For the record, I completely blame chat for that one because I keep on getting trolled by by the sound alerts, and now my reflexes are just complete crap when I hear a creeper doing that. <laughs> so. I blame everybody else but me. Ooh, cows. There is something that I can get from cows that I really want. Those torches there. Ooh, but I need these. I will grab these. Yoink, yoink. Okay, cows. I have looting. Please be good. Give me what I want. Uh-oh. Mr. Danky. Okay. The mossy cobble can go here. We'll do that. Put the flesh in here. We'll put the bones in there. Put the gunpowder in there. There. What the? Okay. And we'll eat this. Alright, cow. Come here. I need it. At least I'm getting cooked steak out of it. There is something that I want that's a very rare drop from these cows. It's because I lit it on fire, isn't it? Okay. Okay. We need to see what's down in here. So I know this is hollow. I 
absolutely am certain this is hollow. Okay, I'll go now. Take me with you! Is this... Is this not hollow? This is a deathbed bunny arena, right? Maybe there's a clue somewhere. I had this label. Huh. I thought this, I had this labeled as a death bunny arena. Was it not? Hmm. Well, we got the webs we needed. Well, I don't know, but we got the webs we needed. That was our objective. So, did I actually even make it? Is this it? Is this not it? Maybe I just mislabeled it. <laughs> not really a Death Bunny Arena. Okay. Whoops, Stingles. All right, well, we'll head back. Ooh, but I need more spider eyes, so I'm glad you're here. Oh, you didn't even drop your eyes. Okay. Well, let's head back home. Vanish! Okay. Those are literally the best potions ever. I love them. It just it gives me the, the happy feet, so I ain't gotta... Do this. Okay. Oh, dang. Sassy, could you get me some water? She's actually gone. Now, does anybody know... The one thing Mr. Danky doesn't like... Is normal stone. It's blacklisted for some silly reason. Like, why? Normal cobblestone can go in here. Why can't you put stone stone in there? I'm gonna have to go into the configs and change that because I cannot. I have. There's no fathomable reason that I can think of why normal stone would not be allowed. Do you guys have any ideas why that might be? I don't want to break anything, but it just doesn't make sense to me that, of all things, stone would be the thing that's like, nope. Can't carry that. All right. Cobwebs. Mission accomplished. Put all this stuff away here. And, uh, you can leave the beef behind. The tomatoes in here. Book and quill. I guess we'll put that here. The other books. Okay. Alright, and let's get all this stuff back. Okay. Enchantment peeling. Food. Eh. You can eat those, so I'll put those in there. Okay, back to not being bad and actually working on work. Aw. Oh, if you must. <laughs> Thank you for dropping by, Lord Billy. Okay. Iron Nugget. Iron Nuggy. There we go. And I haven't quite gotten a handle of how this thing works yet, so we'll put that here. Yep. Won't need the boat in another. Okay, I think the rest is good. Mr. Danky will help us with. Yeah. Let's see. 
What can we take out of Mr. Danky? <laughs> we can take the sand out because we won't find any sand there. And we can take those out too. The rest of that I'll keep in. I want to leave some space in there in case we find some other blocks. I do have a second dank in here somewhere. Where the heck did I put it? Where's the other Mr. Danky? Hold up. Okay, when I find Danky number two, I'm gonna put him inside my. Is he over here? No? No Danky? No Danky. I made him. No Danky. Okay, this is making me sad. Where's the other Mr. Danky? I 100% made two of them. There it is. Okay. There. And we will... Yes! And, uh, what should we call this one? I will be lurking, but I must get this done before my boss. My Joss has a giant hissy fit. Yeah, don't, don't get yourself in trouble over me. <laughs> or you could ask him to watch, too. That's an Earth strategy. Let him know if he subscribes, he can get some awesome emotes. <laughs> hey, boss, have you seen this guy? He eats cheese really weird. What should I call this? Just D? <laughs> okay. Let's see, this one will be real fat, I don't know. I don't know why that's its name, but Professor Fumbles. Okay. Oh, Fade is losing it. He's going crazy. Okay. <laughs> All right, we only have 18 minutes left of slow falling, so we're going to take our other slow falling potions with us. Now give us another hour. Heck, slow falling is something I don't want to be without. He went into the application we use to make websites and is totally... Wait. He went into the application we use to make websites and totally didn't understand it. I'm not sure it's safe to let him roam on Twitch at this point. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> the truth. I believe you. I believe you. Okay. So we need work stone. Oh, Mr. Danky. Bricks. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight bricks. And we'll take our charcoal. Get ourselves some cracked bricks. The amount we have to hold his hands for things that are tech base is crazy. <laughs> Reminds me of my dad a little bit. I love him, but there was like one time he, he called me over to his house to help him with the computer because he said it wasn't working well, and all he needed me to do was type in Google in the web address bar. <laughs> it's his birthday today, by the way. He is 76. He just got done hiking in Yellowstone for two weeks. He's doing so good. 
Okay, crack stone bricks. Okay, so now we just need a compass, which we have. Eats fades cookies. Blues! Not for Malamute. They have chocolate. That's they're, they're bad for you. You can't do that. Okay, we need... Give him a hug when you see him next. I miss my dad. Oh, I'm sorry, little Billy. I'll be sure to do that. Yeah, I'm... I'm very happy that he actually retired not that long ago. Um... He was a bus driver, and um, he did it for the uh, special needs kids. He really loved his, his kids, but um, we were worried because you can't really socially distant in that environment. You know, with COVID-19 and everything, I'm very glad he retired when he did. He, he never caught it. He got vaccinated. He got out, and uh, he's able to enjoy his retirement, and I'm very happy for them and a little bit jealous. Uh, but I, I am vicariously living through uh, them right now. I'm very happy that they're able to do that. They took like a three-week vacation in Yellowstone. And uh, soon we're going to be visiting them, and they're going to have all their stories. And Blue, stop eating my cookies! <laughs> <sighs> Sassy needs to watch those better. Okay. Explorer's Compass. So we need a way home. We need some obsidian. Bits! Ah, <sighs> blues. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. And those can go in Mr. Danky. I think. I'm not going to be carrying that much obsidian. Though they'll stay here. Okay. Let's do this. Visit my Wobble Dog stream or I'll keep eating everything. Uh, being blackmailed now. Okay. Here we are. Our pants are weak. They'll be okay. We need to go explore his compass. Okay. Wow. Nether, city pyramid, end city, eternal portal, fortress. That's what we want. Found. One thousand two hundred thirty three blocks away. Okay, let's do it first. I want to test something. Can I place test? It's doing that thing again. All right, well, I'm not going to worry about that for right now. This way. Lol, I'm, I'm lurking blues. I lurk in blues wobble dog streams. She blackmailing you too. <laughs> oh, there's so many cats. I'm floating because I did the thing. Whoop. Nope, don't want any. Scoot. We're stuck up here now. We're stuck up here because of the floating glitch. Momentum is forever. Get me up. There's so many gas here. Not today, no thank you. No thank you. Bad touch ghosts. Okay, there's a bastion, but that's not what we're here for. I'm pretty sure those are... Let's see, we need to get these scissors out of here. Let's do this. Are those marked? Post. Team Sassy. Wait, I mean fake. Post. Post. Wait, wait. 
That's okay. Guys, Post is just doing doing the role, a double agent. And um He's on our side, I guarantee it. Hey! Hey! No! 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 Ah! No. Okay. Guys. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. Ah, oh, I'm way too floaty. I'm too floaty. Hashtag Team Wolf. Is this Team Wolf? Okay. So we need to get around this thing. How close were we to a fortress then? Oh my... You're rude. Okay. Hello. Ah! Post! Thank you! Yeah, post is on my side. Look at that. Yeah. Boy, it blew up all over the place. Ah! Oh man, that's gonna be going on for a while, isn't it? <laughs> Woo! Heck yeah! Thank you, post. Bam! Oh my goodness. Post found. <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. There we go. What's this? Okay, well, since we're here, we do need to visit this little place. See what treasure we have. Okay. We will call... We have to label this. Let's see. I have an idea. I have an idea. We're going to label this... The... Tr The piglin out post. Get it? <laughs> Jeez. Oh my goodness. Post just went nuts. I can't fall because of things. Hi, guys. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh no. Oh no. Don't, do not kill me. Do not kill me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm almost dead. No, 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 Woo! Yes! I love these enchanted things. Okay. Awesome. Mm! Okay, okay, okay. That's amazing. Okay. I'm gonna break out the junk thing. Let's get those in there right away. Awesome. Oh, no, no, no. I ain't... I'm not dead. Okay, that's better food right now. We'll put... This right here. And we need to pick up all this. Crossbow and the uncooked pork chops. It's more chance and we can load up on things later. Oh, I can hear that they're mad at us. Let's do this quickly. Okay, we're back up to full. I was drawing on my pants. They're fine. Yep, there's more piglet. These guys are going to be... Sp oh, no. Yeah, we got it. These guys are strong. We have to... You know what? We're just gonna go. Where's our... There. We need to loop back around. Can we get above this? Yes. There we go. 
We'll go this way. Okay, we're all right. We're all right. We survived, guys. We survived. There's a tunnel. We'll go down this way, kind of float on through. Okay, we need to head that direction through the chains. There we go. Okay. We'll just keep on going. Come on. There we go. We have five minutes left of feather falling. Keep an eye on that. Okay, we gotta be careful. This is some more, uh, can that stuff hurt us? Yes. Okay. Those things are a little bit... Oh, this is a hazardous biome. That's a lot of nether quartz, though. That's pretty nice. Raw quartz? Huh. Can this be done, made out of, let's see, raw quartz? I was hoping you could smelt that or something, make it smooth. Oh, these guys are hurting themselves on this stuff. Is that a city down there? Ow, we gotta get out of here. Okay. There we go. Well, we'll just float across, I guess. <laughs> okay. Hellhound! Hellhound! We need these guys. We need them really bad. Ugh! Yes! Do you know why? Do you know why? Because that. But we still need blaze rods. Those horns are very important, but we need... That's because this is a normal nether biome, that's why. Okay, we gotta check something. Okay, we are on our side of the portal, good. You know, Sassy's gonna have that, uh... Uh-oh. Gotta concentrate real quick. More floating. Can we be back on the ground? Okay, this way. If Sassy's gonna have that facility, the villager syndicate of hers, she's become all gangster and dangerous. We need a facility too. We can corner the market on another fortress. Oh, good, there's still a passage here. Okay. Let's make it through. Following our compass. Yep. Let's see. We've got some pork chops from the Bastion. Okay, let's let's get above. Oh man, did I ever love. Okay, now, we got a minute and 30 seconds left, so I think I'm going to take another one of these, because I do not want to run out of bad time. I see that pig. I see you. Nope. Yep. More pork chops. Okay. So we should go this way. This compass is the best. We'll just avoid those guys. I 
exclamation point eat. Yeah. Yeah, that, that needs to be a thing too. We need a lightning bolt sound. We need an exclamation point eat. There's a chest there. Okay, there's a lot of these pigs. We gotta be careful. Alright, it's one down. They're knocking us around, but they're not doing too much damage. Okay. You know, what's good is they're keeping us fed. We're getting leather from them, too, which is going right into Mr. Danky, which I love. <clears throat> okay, we're going to have to take care of these guys so we can get into that chest. Nope. much in there. Okay, Mr. Danky. Bones. Okay, <clears throat> we're running out of space. Let's get that out of there. Junk one, there we go. Get rid of that. I heard that. Yeah, I heard him drawing his bow. Okay. I'll let those two fight. Okay. Mr. Danky should definitely have this. There. That'll give us some space. Actually, and probably the gold nuggets, too. <clears throat> okay. Perfect. Okay. This way. Is it above us? It says this is a fortress. Is there one up here? I don't see any fortress here. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. There is no fortress here. Sits down to watch and wait for a response from my boss as I swear he requests things but isn't ever clear on what he's actually wanting. <laughs> I'm just going to go straight down. Maybe I'll land on it. I got feather falling and fire protection, so I shouldn't be in any danger. Do you hear that? I hear it. I'm hearing glazes. This thing was so hidden! Look at this underground freaking fortress! 
I never would have found this. And there's a spawner right there. Okay, okay. Okay, this is huge. Very huge. And we just got blaze rods. This is excellent. Okay. Just in case my thing doesn't actually. There. I've got a screenshot saved just in case. I can't believe this. I never would have found this place. Hi, Fade, the grapefruit lover of doom. Eh. I feel like you're misrepresenting me there, Zaprof. I don't know about that one. We finally found this fortress, so this is botted, so all the vanilla biomes are rare. And this thing is hidden inside a mountain. We only found it because we made this compass. But here, finally, we have access to Blaze. Oh, this is so good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, baby, baby. I came prepared, I'm afraid. Fire protection. That's right. Potions for days. Just don't let them touch me. I'm gonna get tons of these. Oh, that one fell right in the fire, didn't it? <laughs> this is excellent. <clears throat> okay. So this is a major success. Okay, you can't be there. You're gonna shoot at me all day. Yeah, that's... Uh, okay. Alright, let's go over here. This has got to get marked. We have to mark this. Hmm. Yeah, this thing is just... This is all, like, under rock as well. You are gonna love them, you pink colored citrus. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Let's see. We'll call this the Kawaii. <laughs> Buried. <laughs> Fortress. Okay, there you go. How was Strawberry? Well, Strawberry is in trouble with Alan right now because Alan purchased a um, a pond and a very nice lily pad, which Sassy later came and um, confiscated. And now he's been left with a paper bag over here. And uh, he was even written a deed. Deed for Alan, but apparently it's not valid, and um, he got it from Strawberry, so there's a little bit of drama going on right there. Strawberry's in a bit of trouble. Done. Okay, it didn't mark. Okay, one moment, guys. I gotta do something. Let's disconnect. Go back in. And we'll see if that worked. Okay, good. I just have to refresh. Okay, that's cool. All right.
Alright, sweet. Well, I might as well get a lot of these while I'm here. No idea how many I need. But I am gonna grab as many as I can, because this was so hard. You know, while we're here, might see if there's any wither skeletons. Still got plenty of time. It's like a double spawner for these things, too. So glad I combined swords and got looting on this before I left. Okay. So, let's eat. Whoa, what's going on there? Oh, it's because I clicked. I don't need that anymore. Okay. Let's get Professor Fumbles up. We'll put those in here. There we go. And now that will pick up. Yeah. So now what should happen is all of these blaze rods should go into Mr. Fumbles. Good. Okay, very nice. Okay. Let's get these bottles out of here. Another bricks. You know what? If I get acquiring this sword, it'd be really nice too. Do one last little load here. Explore the fortress a bit. Head off home. I need the XP anyway, to be honest. So I don't have a. Uh... XP farm. Now, Sassy can get XP by trading infinitely, so she's good there. And we declared the fishing rod trick where you just continually try to disenchant a cursed fishing rod as illegal. So I need to figure out another way of getting... I got enough. Okay, let's see. Wow, my... We gotta fix that. That's not the right spot. Kawaii Buried Forcus. Okay, we will relabel that and put it here. Kawaii! Buried Fortress. Done. There it is. Okay. Stop that. Alright. See if there is the find here. Went up some steps. Does that continue or is it just done? It's just done. Not a very big fortress. Lots of blaze. Not many on the wither skeleton front. some more passages. Hmm. There's literally no wither skeletons here to be found, are there?
Well, there are some biomes nearby that have skulls that do drop wither skeleton skulls when they die, and also some naga. So we can harvest it from there. We need to get 9 or 10, probably 13. Okay. Skulls. Preferably. Let's see. Alright, Professor Fumbles, how many do we have? 71. Are we on hard mode? We should be. Good. Okay. Just do a little harvest here. And then we'll head back home. One thing I do wish we did was create a, uh... I wish we had brought a waystone with us. I really wish we had a, uh, ender pearl. back here whenever we want. Okay. Well, let's go back and see where we are. Oh, wait. Some space bubble. Oh, we are far. We are super far. These are cool looking trees though. These cherry logs are pretty. Okay, let's uh, pacify the region here. Okay. Goodness. There's a lot of you. Pretty area. Yeah, we really want to mark this area. We need to find an enter. Oh, there's ice biomes out there. Ah, no! <sighs> not cool, creeper. Not cool. All right, Mr. Danky, we need you. You know what? I'll keep these sunflowers. We need them for our base. <laughs> I need to mark this area. And our mission now is to get an ender pearl. We just need an enderman. Then I can make a waystone. We can mark this spot. That way we can teleport to it later using our warping ritual. Okay. We're way down here. <laughs> okay. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Ah. Oh. I need to 
remember how to use my brain. There we go. Okay. Passage 2. Why? Buried. Kawaii. Fortress. Hmm. Too big. Sure. And I'm going to sneeze. Excuse me. Okay. Now hopefully we can get lucky and we can find a uh Enderman. Let's wander around a bit. dark out here because of all the tree cover. Maybe we'll get lucky. There's plenty of zombies. Or maybe just a place where there's like an ender pearl, maybe. Sassy would love this place. It is beautiful. It's very pink. Let's see what we can see here. I'm looking for like Places where there might be treasure. Wow. There we go. There's our target. Maybe we'll find an ender pearl there. It's my people. My pillagers. They won't let me down. Yes. Hey, hello, my friends. For those who aren't familiar, as a witch, I am pillager aligned. Villagers won't trade with me, but pillagers also won't attack me. Hello! Ha! Ah. Stand down, my friend. We're among the allies. Now. You kind sirs. Do you have any ender pearls that I might borrow? May I borrow a cup of ender pearl? You got a hole under your base. You might want to take a look at that. So don't mind me. I'm, I'm just going to climb up the side of your building here. And, and see if you have any ender pearls in here. Crafted by Illager Geomancers, this item is enchanted with the power of a stormy sky. Anima conduit. Well, you guys got some tasty stuff here. I might just, um, you know, we're on the same side here, so I'll just be, uh, I'll just be taking that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. There's a village over there, too. Villager outpost and a village right next to each other. Look at that. All right. Hello, sir. Keep on doing the good work. 
You know what? Building a base where a villager outpost is would be really good for me. It would constantly spawn in pillager, vill, bl, 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 pillagers. And they would never attack me. Hey, Chris. I'm scheming. How are you today? Huh. Yeah. Hmm, hmm, hmm. So, so. Been worse. I'm glad you're doing all right. Let's see. We need to name this. So, tower. That would be one heck of a deterrent to other players trying to raid your base. Yes, it would. Yes, it would. Let's see. Um... Dang, this would be a great last stand area, I think. Yeah, we definitely can't leave until we get an Ender Pearl. We we have to mark this spot. Hello, B. Hi. Okay, we need a good label for this. It's right next to a village. It's in a cherry blossom forest. Let's see. We'll call that. Death Petal Keep? I don't know. That sounds kind of cool. <laughs> Ooh, how about... Let's see. Keep of the... Ooh. Dusk Rose. That sounds cool. Does that sound cool? I think that sounds cool. Done. Yeah! I like ye. I like ye a lot. Okay. So, this is definitely something, okay, we need Ender Pearl, like really bad, and there's ice over here too, oh, this is such an awesome area, okay, and just beyond this portal goes directly into another fortress, which are very rare in this server, thanks to all the other mods that are inside the pack. There's not a lot of vanilla nether left for fortresses to spawn in, and the one that we found was buried. And it's deep on my side of the map as well. Ender pearls? No, but we got tranquilizers. Okay. Let's do that. Uh, okay. We gotta be careful about golems. They will murder us on sight. Hello, sir. More tranquilizers. Yeah. Have to be careful. That guy right there. He's trouble. He's a lot of trouble. Okay. What? You guys see that? Did you guys see that? Okay, just a second. Oh, there are so many shenanigans going on here. Okay. You don't mind if I bunk with you, mate, right? Oh, everything's coming up fade today. Okay. No, no, don't push me out there. There's baddens out there. But I saw... Yeah, that's like a mansion. It looks like. What are the chances there'll be enderpearls in there? <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little bit nervous because I know... Okay, we gotta get down there. I gotta avoid the vanilla golem at the very least. That's a straight up mansion, guys! <sighs> Cherry Blossom Estates welcomes you.
Boy, that village is in a tough spot, man. They... You kicked out the pillagers, and they just went and made an outpost on one side and a mansion on the other. Oh, where's the front door? <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. I'm just looking for the front door. I don't want to break in if I can help it. Here, I have an idea. We will head on top. Okay. Oh, this is fantastic. Yeah, that village, uh, is a bit cornered. Outpost on one side, pillager, out, uh, mansion on one side, pillager outpost on the other. Okay. I think in order to find the front door, I'm going to have to break in. We'll repair it. Okay. There we go. And Mr. Danky... That didn't work. Come, Mr. Danky, come here. Yeah. And we'll repair. One, two. There. Okay. I appear to be locked in. That skeleton won't be friendly, though. Hello, sir. Yep, carry on. Doing good work. Keeping those villagers in line. You know, they won't talk to me. Can, can I get inside here? Okay. But you guys haven't have any pearls. Ooh, I'll take the skull, though. Alright. Woo! TSL, subscribe for half a year. Welcome to the chat. We just came across random Woodland Mansion. We've gone 7,000 blocks in the nether. Ooh. I don't want to blow this up. There we go. And we popped out the other side. There is a fortress. And a little mansion. Oh no. I'll fix it, guys. I'm sorry. All right, guys. I got gotcha. you. I'll fix it. Somebody here die. Oh, I don't want them to die. I, I need those guys to stay alive. Okay. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to get everything killed here if I keep... You know what? Just... Let me in here for a second. Okay. My inventory is a catastrophe. So this, this, tranquilizers, the flowers. Okay. Dark oak logs. Fix this. Okay. And we need food, like right now. really want a uh, Enderman so we can mark this place
Okay, we got keep our wits about us here. Let's just keep looking. Okay, we got wool. Worried about the creepers. Skeletons, come on. Just an Enderman, come on. Just need an Enderman. Or some chests. Lots of monument rooms. There's an upstairs. Okay, here's the front front door. Okay, well here since we're here at the front Oh, these Japanese maples look beautiful. Okay. Let's mark this. And we will call this... Cherry Blossom Estates. Yeah, that, that that village. There's another village right here. This is a very populous region. Okay. Let's get food here. And I cannot see inside here with the uh, atlas, so we'll just put that up here. Okay. All right. Let's. Uh, Oh, good and hello. Welcoming committee here. Uh, guys, your friends don't like me. Hello, buddy. You do have something I need, but... I'm content to let you guys hold on to it for now. There's lots of vindicators up here. Wow, are they all Vindicators? <laughs> Imagine how hard this place would be if uh, I weren't aligned. I need Endermen. A very nice library. This is awesome. Evoker. Are there are two invokers in here. There are. Oh, I really want those totems of undying, but they're kind of on my side, so I don't really want to. That's just a bathroom. Yes. Fantastic. I'm looking for chests. Oh, asking you shall receive. Ender Pearl. Aw. Nope. Mr. Danky. Instructions for this place. There's the library again. Need to find it upstairs. Here's where I came from. There's the evokers. So that stair steps up? I think so. I would love, sorry, protection from fire. Indicator. 
There's more upstairs. Another library. Boxing ring. Maybe there's a chest up here? Yes. My under pearl. Flesh, we got the bones. Actually, we don't really need that stuff right now. We're doing just fine. I will take the apple, though. I know, right? Okay. Climb over fences, that's cool. Okay. That's where I came from. Do you guys not have any ender pearls in your wealth here? I got my. Uh oh! No! Dag nabbit. I'm too floaty. I can't, uh. Sorry, guys, but you got a pest problem. Real. Yeah, it's not my intention to wreck your home. Do any of you guys have any ender pearls? The, uh, it's the creepers I don't like. Oh yeah, Johnny! Take care of them! Dag nabbit! Quit breaking my home! I wish they'd aggro on them when they hit me. That'd be nice. I need an enderpearl to work. No. No. Okay. Fix this hole. Well, that would be death if I fell down there. The creepers are checking out the library. Okay, I need uh, Mr. Danky. Here, we'll. Uh... Sorry about that. Uh, we'll put some carpet over it. It'll be fine. Okay, there we go. Oh, dude, dude. What's up? <laughs> it's fine. Good as new. Perfectly fine. Um. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> I, I am marking this place before I leave. Okay, it's maybe I'll do better if I go outside. Because it is night. Okay, we'll go outside. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Okay. Enderman, please. Ah! You're a vampire! You're not friendly! You're not friendly at all! P pillagers! This is new! This is new! That's right, I got wards! Bottle of blood. Well, thank you! <laughs> Fine then. Maybe you should just go rename one of the Vindicators as Johnny to help you clear out the mobs. I would love if they would like aggro when, um, when I'm hit. Yeah! 
Don't do it, I'm outside! It's a bad idea! Sassy might have her pet snake, but I got lightning bolts! Do it. Now we got piglins. Oh boy. Okay, we don't need the bow and... Okay, junk thing. Even this is getting full. Everything's getting full. Okay, that, that, and uh, string. Bottle of blood is huge. We're going to keep that safe. We should probably put this on our on our bar here so we have an emergency thing. Mr. Danky and Professor Fumbles. Okay. Take all of this. Okay. Feather apples, bread, taters. That. Okay. Nope. It was just chilling outside of this uh, village. Right there. Now there is a... Golem here, so we gotta be very careful. And we're okay, we don't need to take that right now. doesn't see us will be fine oh it's okay it's 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 he's okay he's cool with us he's cool that guy's cool I think that's the laser golem he's okay with us Yeah, yeah, we're good. Oh! Oh! Wait, are you a quartz? You a quartz golem? Okay, he's cool with us too. I just need an enderman! I've already found that. Yeah, it's a bad idea. Probably shouldn't do that. As you can see, Sassy, I has defenses. Is that a vampire? I'm killing him first. Yeah. Man, I'd see Endermen all over the place at my home. But none of them are here. By the way, um, Professor Fumbles. How'd you find those? I used my explorer's compass and I found one. It was buried. There's no way I would have ever found it. We know they exist. Yeah, and they have spawners. I kill every cow I see now. What am I going to do about Ender Pearl, though? I, I need to. I can't trade with them either. I can't even do that strat. Well, the fact that you have flame on your sword make a difference to the drop. To the what now? To the drop that you're looking for. The fact you have flame. If the fire tick kills them instead of the sword, I don't think I get the um, the loot on it. Hello. That's it. I bet it is. I bet it is. That's a loud death. Yes. Yeah, this is a very populous region. I need an ender pearl. I'm sticking to your walls. This could be cramped quarters to fight a golem in, and I don't want to do it.
well. Stairs are hard because I float. Hello? Ooh. Oh no no. Webs in a chest. Hello, sir. Okay. <laughs> okay. And a pearl? See a golem, I'll be fine. Sticking to the walls is really annoying. Oh! What's hitting me? There. Nothing. More oh, the bane of my existence. Steps. So my head keeps on sticking to the ceiling. Yeah, it's so unsafe for villagers. Kind of all kinds of full. Hmm. Guess we're gonna. That's Ender Pearl! Enderman! I hear an Enderman! Okay. I just heard an Enderman. What's this? Some kind of top secret underground villager compound? Yes! There's all sorts of shenanigans going on here. Okay, where is. I'm hearing. Is there a wall behind this? Where are you? Where are you, Enderman? Oh! Endymen! Oh, so many Endymen! Hi! Sorry, you must die. I need your balls! Yes! I got them! I don't know what this is. No, I'm not allowed to die here. I'm not looking at you. I'm not looking at you. What is this? This is an awesome mine shaft. Guys, I gotta go home. I, I can't do this right now. Okay, um. Take all this. Okay. I need your balls, Fade Twin. <laughs> Leave me alone! <laughs> so far this episode, this is a great way to get tongue, and I need your balls. Yep. Great. Thank you, stream. Thank you, chat. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Couldn't have done it without you. Okay. So that means we do this. We do this. Bye-bye. Waystone. Finally. In fact, let's grab this guy too. Nice. Okay, good. Because we got to explore this, don't we? I mean, come on. So I'm going to label this. Oh, this has got to be something special. This almost looks like a fortress or something. There are 100% spiders over there. Okay. We can't risk dying. So we will... Okay. We'll get our silky. Let's get a little bit more stone. Bits! <laughs> Thank 
you blows. I'm just gonna crawl up the wall here where you can't hit me. And I'm gonna eat. <laughs> I returned to you dying. Except I'm alive! Bits! Thank you. Thank you, Zaprof. Thank you, everybody. Okay. Adrenaline's still coursing from before. Okay. Okay. Bits! I, I, I'm ready for it this time. <laughs> mm. Okay, we got two waystones. So waystone number one. Oh, that's where he's been poking us from. Stop following me! <laughs> Thank you, White Line, for following. <laughs> okay, we're gonna mark this. Okay, that's marked. Bits. Junk pack poo. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Kiss bits. Yes, thank you. Thank you for joining in the insanity. Now we just gotta make our way back out of here. Let's see, we can climb. Climb up. We'll rock it. Oh, hi. I couldn't find him in to sit. And now we're floating away. Okay, let's try this again. We got potions on us. Uh-oh. Back to the corner. Back to the wall. This is a crazy underground chasm. Okay, we just need to... Get out of here. Oh, you know blues? That's not a friendly new follower message. <laughs> Are you here to invade? Okay. And let's put... Let's block that off because that is going to actually flood the entire area down there. Okay. So that was awesome. We're going to explore that later. We, we got a um, wavestone mark of it. Okay, this is the entrance to the underground village we found. Now, we just need to get back to, uh... Let's see, we don't need that. Okay. Atlas. Need to make it back to the portal, to the Buried Kwai Fortress. Okay. So, um, that way... This has been a very good journey today. So, we went on a hike to find, uh, what was it, cobwebs, so we could make Explorer's Compass, which lets you, uh, it'll give you the cords, or at least point you to the direction towards certain structures. That was important because our nether is modded, and uh, there's not very many vanilla biomes, or there's, hard, there's more biomes, so the vanilla ones are harder to find, which means fortresses are harder to find, so blaze rods were, like, at a premium. But we found one, and we have, like, 80 blaze rods now. It's coming night. We should rest. I see ghosts. Snowden Morning's minions. Okay. Now, we're not worried about this outpost. Because we are witch, or I prefer warlock. We are pillager aligned, so they will not bother us. Now we have a plan. Now Sassy's gone again. This right here, I'm going to deconstruct, and I'm going to build my base here. Which will mean these guys will always spawn passively around it and serve as defenders. Won't that be something else? Natural bodyguards. Okay. So we need a straight.
straighten up straight this way. You should give White Lion a follow. She is worth it. 100%. Oh! Um, did you ISO? Is White Lion a uh, stream as well? Chris saying she's worth it's the only uh, endorsement I need. Yeah. Okay, we passed it. Okay, let's go this way. We got spider. We got several potions on us right now. <laughs> yeah, that's a snorkel. So right now we got slow falling is about to run out. We should probably re-up that here soon. We got night vision, climbing, fire resistance, and water breathing from our snorkel. Okay. No problem, white lion. That's a cool name, by the way. I like it. Okay. So we need to rotate, pivot. I was told to come back and check check you out by post today. <laughs> post, yeah, post went crazy in here today. We had fade explosions going on for ten minutes straight. I swear. <laughs> awesome. Well, that's awesome. That's nice. That is the number one best way, I think, to grow is just have people kind of word of mouth uh, spread your presence around. That's that's awesome. Greatly appreciated. Where the heck is this portal? This way. Spiders. I do need your eyeballs. Okay. There it is. Perfect. Okay, so this one, we'll just do that right here. 9,000 blocks away. Yeah, we do not want to lose that. Okay, now we can go home. There are a lot of new people I meet lately and hard to keep up with them. <laughs> I know, right? Ninja, vanish! Ha ha ha! Yes! And before we forget what it is... We're, well, we're going to first do this because our sound is bugged. Then we're going to take a victory bite of sandwich. Mmm. Yes. Mmm. Much meatball. Such sandwich. Chunk loading that. Okay. Your wife is so cute. She is running around a stress monster. Yep. She's, um... She, met Antonio, and myself are the admins for stress. And we're running, a, also simultaneously running a uh, event for <laughs> the monsters, I think, um, on the server. Okay. So what was I doing? Mmm, sandwich. Sandwich. Okay, we'll put the stone away. Boom. And we'll do that. And we keep on getting distracted. Okay, so the waystone, this was for... Let's see. I don't want to forget what this is important for, so we'll call it a... Uh, is the Kawaii Buried Fortress. That's where the Ender Pearls were. Okay. You need a redemption or Agent Johnson. Oh. Yeah. Um, Blues, if you want to, like, message that to me in Discord to serve as a reminder, I will, um... What else did we say that I needed? Lightning bolt. Um, that was another redemption. Um, random lightning bolt, since apparently those like to strike me. Ah, those are good ideas. I'll remind you if, if Luz doesn't. Awesome. I love my chat. My chat is good people. Okay, now we need to find the other waystone. There it is. This waystone. And that one. 
either alchemist points or bits. There is a, um, what's it called? Pathfinder. Uh, the alchemists, alchemists use like, a, oh, what's it called? There's, there's a, there's a substance that was made up for the series and the and alchemy, alchemy, alchemists use it. This is for the fancy mine shaft that we found. Perfect. Where am I putting my waystones? Right here. So we got Quibrid Fortress, Fancy Mine Shaft, Keep. I guess I got two for the keep for some reason. Um a mysterious keep. So this is a teleportation circle. We can use those waystones. Fade never respond. <laughs> I, I know I'm kind of bad about responding to the messages blues, but I do read them. Um, I do read them. With all the admin stuff that I do, and the fact that I'm a complete introvert, <laughs> I just don't... I don't know. I look at them, and I don't want you to stop. I enjoy seeing what you have to say. It's just like, I read them and I'm like, get a warm fuzzy and then I kind of don't respond because I'm bad that way. I, I need to do better. Okay. So, blaze rods were in... Oh! We gotta go back to the fortress. There is something very important there that we need. Um, what's it called? Dragon. Dragon's blood. Saplings. Okay, it's, um... Yeah, these are very important. These are high-end... They are found in loot in nether fortresses. Minimum? Minimum. I messaged... I messaged him, you should too. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm behind in my, my comments. See, 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 terrible, terrible. Um, I did do like a personality profile myself and I found that I'm a 90%... 90 <laughs> To be fair, I end up getting lots of messages from a lot of different sources because of the whole admin thing. And so, no, I don't tend to respond that often. That's true. It's hard for that to be sustainable. I get hundreds of messages, and I just... If I responded, that'd be all I did. Um, and then we always respond to the YouTube messages. I mean, that's like a rule. Um, but I do read them. I read everything. Uh, what was I thinking about? I was going to do something. Put stuff away till I remember. Right, I need to go back to the fortress. I need to go back to the fortress. Oh. Scrap. Hold up. This is kind of huge, though. Ancient debris. Debris. Ancient Debra. Hello, what's that? Okay, is this... We need golden coronation. We need to keep at least one of these. I don't know what this is, but it's needed. One scrap, one scrap.
Okay, so we're going to need at least one raw, because apparently that's needed in a ritual. Okay. And then... The scrap... Hellish bobble? We have the horns. Fiery serum, we can make that now. A mending poppet. A netherite candelabra. That thing better be incredible if we're going to use it for that. And we can make a netherite ingot if we have four. So one, two. Excellent. So we can... Okay. So we can keep one of these for the ritual. We can turn two of these, one of these, into a, a scrap. This is way overkill, but actually, you know what? We don't need two of those. <laughs> Oh, is it not going to be enough? Oh, baloney. Okay. Okay, guys. We have one... We will be able to make one refined piece of netherite. What do we use it on? Let's see. What is in here? Oh, dang, but that hellish bobble could be good, too. I want to know what that does before I spend it on this. Black tree. Another right fire bowl. Yikes, that's expensive. Orb of origin. You can change your origins? Well, that's powerful. Your magic... Fart hat. I do, do I still... Am I still... Oh, did I lose my... The time of troubles. We lost our whoopee cushions. That's sad. Okay, let's, let's go back and see here. Okay. We were checking to see what all we could make with the netherite. I don't know if I, if I actually does. Yeah, the Orb of Origin was huge. We can make the Dark Katana. That takes a ton of it. Soul Scythe. The Truth Seeker. Oh, these are awesome looking weapons. Lodestone, which I can't use. We can severely upgrade our storage. Netherite armor. Weapons. Netherite kitchen knife. That is clearly the play. Netherite staff at building. Netherite wand. Aren't flail actually is what leeches use to be immortal. Le leaks. Yes, they are. We don't have enough to make two, though. I don't know how that mechanic would be represented in the game, or how it would interact with me being a spirit. So I think we need to find out what that mask does first, right? So let's just see if we can figure out... Oh, that's the wrong book. I have lots of magical books. Books of Shadows. See, Book of Shadows, I'm like, okay, that kind of sounds evil. It was like, Necronomicon. Oh, that seems to sound even more evil. Science Journal, it seems pretty safe. Sassy's on Discord call too, so your internet is buffing, buffering. Is it? We should be just fine. We got loads of internet. We haven't had internet issues for like almost a solid year. 
All right, hold up. I can check. No, we should be doing okay. Quality. We have we have all our quality options available as well. The other eight kitchen knives should do massive damage while making very prominent doink visual sound effect. <laughs> Man, the netherite knife should be like... It should like quadruple the food that you get out of it or something. I mean, it, honestly, like the knife doesn't have any durability when you use it for a sandwichable. So you don't even... All you really need is a wood knife. The diamond knife is just for like... I liked how it looked. Um, it, I it, The material should do something i maybe the food that you get out of it is for some reason more saturating or something i don't know okay but we got to find out here book of shadows oh we um i haven't unlocked something in the book of shadows forever so this is exciting what did we get Dragon blood trees. This is why we have to go back. Dragon's blood saplings are found in nether fortresses. Cutting through the bark with an ethane will cause them to yield dragon's blood resin. Blocks made of this wood will give off an aura of power and can be given active sigils. Sigils are cool. Sigils are cool, guys. Okay, and also, I like how this stuff looks. Okay, we have all the blocks. Okay, tools. Hellish Bobble. Through the power of fire, the Hellish Bobble extinguishes any flames using some ME. Note that this does not enable you to swim in the nether. The bobble does not protect against direct damage from lava. Being made out of netherite, this item is completely fireproof. Okay, so... Let's talk about that. We presently have an obsidian skull, which gives us temporary fire immunity for like, I don't know, 15 seconds when we get lit on fire. Um, we have fire protection potions, which we can make, which last a ridiculous amount of time. We took one at the beginning of the stream, and we still have 18 minutes left. Um, I don't think... Okay, I don't think that's the best use, because we got other things that do enough similar things, and with fire protection, you can swim lava. So I don't... As cool as that looks, if we get some spare stuff, I'll probably make it, but I don't think that's what we're using it for. Brazer. What's the brazer do? The brazer is an essential tool for curses. Other than that, it can be used for incense. What the heck is incense? Oh, we're getting some good stuff, guys! Ugh! Okay, I, I, I got behind. I was making a reference to the Tomberries in Final Fantasy that were weird Christian knives that can be one shot a max level character that can one shot a max level character. It does it does so with this old school Batman style doink appearing on the screen. <laughs> That's awesome. A brazier can take up to four items. To start using it, you need to light it using a flint and steel. For convenience, braziers can also be attached. Braziers, braz, braziers, 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 not braziers, braziers, can also be attached to ceilings. Oh, it's going to look so good in our fortress. Incenses are simple usage method of the brazier. Incense can be, can apply status effects rather effects after waking up. Simply light a nearby brazier with the needed ingredients and go to sleep. Oh, these are cool. So you'll wake up and you inhale a bunch of magical fumes and you're off the you're good. Night vision, regeneration. Oh, this oh, oh, this is neat. Okay. Okay, cool. Creatures. Demons. Demons are now on the table. Grim beings crawled straight from the pits of hell. Demons are usually summoned and will attack any living being that around them with fire and are weak to smite. Demons can be safely approached with besmirched armor, offering contracts. Slaying a demon will yield at least one demon heart. Duly noted. Wear power. This 
we've seen vampires, guys. Werewolves are also in the pack. And we also put in every modded add-on we could for Bewitchment that was stable. There is a hybrid werewolf vampire. They spawn in taigas, icy biomes, and forests on a full moon. Okay, full moons be scary. Due to their size, they are not able to fly freely despite their wings, though they may use their wings to fling themselves toward their prey, which is usually humanoid. Werewolves will only appear on full moons and will turn back to their normal non-beast form when the morning breaks. Got it. Scary. Vampires. We've encountered these guys. Vampires are master of the night with few weaknesses. They appear in plains and taiga biomes on new moons. So that was relatively rare. Where there's... A the least light. They are known to attack humans, so you should equip yourself against them with fire or smite. Good thing we had fire. Summon wither. Summon demon. Oh. So, we can actually have a cheaper wither summon. Knowing the destructive tendencies of the wither, you probably you probably want to do this somewhere far away from your home. Unlike this, most summon rituals, this does not require sacrifice. Well, it requires ME. We kind of need to be near the home, don't we? Summon demon. We have enough to summon a demon. We can do that. Cost, 666. Nice touch. This ritual appears... This ritual separates a demon from their hellish home by sacrificing a human using an Athane. Demons offer a variety of trades, but they will usually attack you and they offer trades, but will attack you unless you wear besmirched armor. If they do attack you, keep them away from anything flammable. We need demon hearts, and we can now summon demons. Brewing. Corruption. We got new brews. By making a brew out of a demon horn, you can reverse positive potion effect into its negative counterpart. When added as a potion ingredient, corruption will always come out on top, meaning it will re revert. It'll invert all previous effects when quaffed. But not those of the potion. Interesting. Magic sponge. Magic sponge will reduce damage from magic sources and will turn in turn refill the target's ME buffer based on the damage. Higher intensity increases magic dirt. Okay, so if we're flinging magic at each other and I have magic sponge on, that means I'll just absorb whatever energy is shot at me and can use it to power my own power. That's cool. Oh, this is great. What else we got? Sigils. Oh! Uh, oh! Uh, that's a lot. That, that's a lot. Using sigils. Magic symbols of power, they can be divided into groups, active and passive. They need to be placed on blocks or brooms made of dragon's blood. Okay, tag locks can be used. Try and do this quick. Let's see, sigil won't affect anyone the tag lock is from. If it is set as black... Okay, I see, I see. So these are like symbols you can put on things. Cleansing. Active Sigil Cleanser removes all harmful potion effects on whomever activates it. Okay, so these are like uh, buttons that you can place on blocks that will have an effect attached to them. And you can hit it and it will do something. And I think passive ones maybe create an effect in an area. Let's see if we can find a uh, passive Sigil. Passive. Okay, there we go. The heavy passive will magically increase fall damage on any on everything around it. Oh gosh, keep that away from me. So we can make like a gravity trap. Huh. Oh my goodness. Oh man, we can make a house of horrors out of this stuff. Um Ruin. We got blood. Prevents any positive potion effect from taking hold around it. <laughs> oh, that's the anti fade po sigil. We don't want Sassy to know about that one. Smelly? I, I don't really think we should read all these, right? It's stinky, causing... Nearby hostile entities to move towards it. Okay, I guess enemy things like smelly things. We can do this really quick, right? Oh, it's an anti-taglock uh, sigil. 
Let's see. Wait, you can scry with crystal balls? That mean I can spy on Sassy using her tag lock and a crystal ball? Oh, these are good. Double the duration of any incense. Okay. Shrieking. Well, cast a horrible sound and activate. That's an alarm. That's what that is. Sentinel. Traps the spirit of a ghost. Okay. We can trap Snowden Morning. Mending. It will give regeneration and resistance to whoever activated it. Damage to the unholy being. Undead. Okay. And decay. Apply strong wither effect. Okay, so I guess I did read them all. You need rabbit ears. Duly noted. Curses! Oh, good, good. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh. Lightning rod curse? I think I already have that. Outrage, misfortune, solar hatred, unlucky, weak lungs. Arachnophobia, army of worms. These are curses we can toss onto Sassy. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'll, I'll look at those here in a second. Contracts. Concept contracts. Contracts are otherworldly packs purchased from demons at the cost of health. Contracts usually last for seven days, cannot be broken. Let's see what. Okay, Conquest. What's an example? The Forgotten Horseman of Conquest fights but with a bow. While under this contract, your damage from projectiles is doubled. I see. Envy. The Envy contract lets you steal a villager's trades by heartlessly murdering them. I might have just found a way of trading with villagers. <laughs> oh, that, that really makes Sassy mad, though. What does it mean, steal the trades? What does that mean exactly? Gluttony. Doubles the nourishing effect of food. Sassy would love. Oh, I could. Maybe we can tempt her to the dark side. That contract. Greed. Double ores. Nice. Lust. This causes animals bred on whoever has a contract to breed thrice the normal amount. <laughs> Make instant litter. Pride. Experience. That's nice. Slow regeneration, standing still. Getting hurt makes you angry. And with the contract of wrath, you can finally manifest that anger reason reasonably. Finally, I can finally reasonably. Uh, Science contract will increase your damage output with lower health. Okay. Death contract makes you crave the death of other things. Anything slain by your hand will heal you. Oh boy, I can be really evil. Famine. Damage taken is reduced. Reduced the hungrier you are. Interesting. Pestilence. You are able to effectively inflict heavy illness upon your foes. Oh, that's fun. War. Cause aggression amongst nearby entities, causing them to attack each other first. Oh. Oh, there's possibilities. There's so many possibilities. And we haven't read the... I'm curious. Are you curious? I want to know. Uh, conducting curses. Use a brazier. A brazier. I gotta quit doing that. Braz brazier. B R A Z I E R. Brazier. Uh, to cast effectiveness curse, you'll need a tag lock of target, which we have. Put the ingredients in. You can also use it to cleanse. Need 400. Greater curse, use 800. We have over 800. We're fine. Okay. Arachnophobia. Cause massive fear of spiders that may even extend over the duration of the actual curse. Through the power of magic and random asexual reproduction. My guess is this makes spiders appear around them. Army of worms. Any crops near the cursed individual suffer in growth. Oh, that would be so mean. Because how would you even know? Like, you're waiting for your crops to grow and they just don't do anything. You may not even know there's something... That, that's insidious. You wouldn't even know. You would just think there's something wrong with the game. Compromise. Negative effects would be even stronger. Oof. 
This curse casts nature's anguish back to mankind, causing anyone cursed within it, with it to suffer the same way it does. This damage, this doubles damage from fire as well as from axes. So, like, if you chop down a tree, you get hurt. Lightning rod. Susceptible lightning. Any lightning bolt in the target's vicinity will instead redirect directly to them. Mm-hmm. Misfortune. Will occasionally apply nasty effects. These include, but are not limited to poison, weakness, blindness, and nausea. <laughs> no, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh. This is just randomly just going blind. Oh, some of these are mean. Outrage. Neutral mobs as intermittent or zombified piglins will always be aggressive. Oh. Solar hatred. So it makes you a zombie, basically. Unlucky. This means that beneficial status effects may... Oh, that's another one that just feels like... You would just be like, you wouldn't even know. Like, your fortune's not giving you fortune stuff. It's kind of mean. Hard time breathing. When underwater, they will immediately start drowning. Okay. Okay. That's a lot of good stuff. Whew, sorry guys, I think that was like half an hour of me just reading the book, but we ha I had to know what all that stuff did. Okay. So, next time guys, we have a mission. We're going to go back to the fortress, which we can get there very quickly now because we took those uh, waystones. I can teleport back in, search it. Inside that fortress, inside the chest, there should be... Um,